Is T-Rex Miner the new king of LHR unlock? That is the question we will be answering in this video. Yes, okay, I couldn't find a T-Rex with a crown, so just imagine that it's a T-Rex. It's green, that should count for something. Hello my fellow miner, today we're going to have a look at T-Rex Miner version 0.25.11 beta, change stock, overclock settings, low power mode, performance mode, and then of course, the profits. First up, the change lock. Change lock, improved LHR unlock functionality by a few percentage. And then some blah blah blah, don't care, and a bit more of blah blah blah, couldn't care less. We'll also be testing LHR low power mode of course, to see what the results will be. Please note that this is a beta and doesn't represent the final version. Now let's have a look at those fantastic overclock settings, shall we? Overclock settings. It's a beta. Please note that I'm very well aware that the RTX 3050 and RTX 3080 12 gigs works much better when you disable LHR and you overclock them lower. I want to test the LHR unlock ability on these two cards and that is why you see the clocks you see. I have actually tested over 20 different combinations with them and I settled on these because why not? Well, you'll see that in the results section. I'll go through the overclock settings. First I'll start with card, then core, then memory hive and memory windows. RTX 3050, 1500, 1700, 850. RTX 3060, 1552, 2600, 1300. RTX 3060 Ti Hynix Revision 1, 1350, 2100, 1050. RTX 3060 Ti Hynix Revision 2, 1500, 3200, 1600. RTX 3070, 1125, 2600, 1300. RTX 3070 Ti, 900, 2300, 1150. RTX 3080 10 gigs, 1250, 3400, 1700. RTX 3080 12 gigs, 1400, 2400, 1200. To start testing the latest version in HiveOS, simply create and run a flight sheet with version 0.25.9 and then simply run the command as you see here on the screen. I'll also put it on my Medium page as YouTube usually corrupts the link. Please note that the link may actually not work by the time you see the video as this is a beta. If you're using Windows, simply download the zip file. I will not go into details about how to make a batch file as this is a beta. If you already have existing batch files or an existing flight sheet, then please remove your LHR tune settings from them. They will either result in a lot of docs or a lower hash rate. And don't worry, I'll do the full Monty banana split as soon as the final version has been released. Quickly moving on like a ninja, let's have a look at the average reported results. Average results. And by average, I actually mean average. And here we have the average results. I know what you are thinking. Oh jolly donkey mate, bring back the old chart. Here have some tea you bloody wanker. Or something along those lines. Well I will not bring back the old chart because it was very hard to read on mobile phones. However, I am very well aware that this is but ugly as well. Consider it a beta for now. Hopefully not a Google Labs beta, where it's a beta forever. Now let's compare the results with LotMiner version 1.48. And here we see that T-Rex Miner is actually faster and more efficient throughout. But please note that G-Miner is actually better when it comes to the RTX 3080 12 gigs by 7 mega hash per second. That said, no one actually has one with the exception of me, so everything is fine. I think it's time to have a look at the mining screen before we move on to the profits. At the top we have the normal mode slash performance mode and at the bottom we have low power mode. Yes, it's running on the guinea rig which is my LHR test rig with all the graphic cards with the exception of the RTX 3080 Ti, which is back at repairs again. I got it back, it still didn't work, I've sent it again. Anyway, I think to note here is the memory temperature. 
and a very crazy power fluctuation uh, in low power mode but that is kind of the trademark of the low power mode. And then we also have the LHR values where you can see that in low power mode you actually have lower LHR values. I think that is pretty much what is worth seeing on the mining screen so now let's move on to the profits. If you are interested in seeing this daily then you can actually visit my new channel and subscribe there and you'll get a daily video update every single day even in the weekends. You can find the link in the description and also in the pinned comment. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did then subscribe, hit the like button and share it with your grandma. See you in the next one.